Hello everyone, this video is on the module descriptor of communication and extension EXT101. This video will take you through the content and the assessment part of the module. Let's look at the outline. So we have the general objective, learning outcomes, teaching and learning approach, assessment approaches, overview of the assessment approaches and weightings, subject matter and the reading list. General objective. The module will provide the students the understanding of the importance of communication and extension in rural development. It will enable the students to develop effective communication skills and acquaint to various extension tools for the dissemination of innovation. Learning outcomes. On the completion of the module, the learners will be able to identify the basics of communication and extension, describe in brief the history of extension in Bhutan, explain the organizational structure of the Ministry of Agriculture and Forest, evaluate budgeting and office management process, apply various extension methods relevant to the daily activities, apply various communication techniques for effective delivery of extension activities, use participatory rural appraisal, PRA tools in assessing rural conditions and plan development activities. Organize presentation and exhibitions during the block week on PRA and RRA. Teaching and learning approaches. The approaches that will be used are lecture, practical, which will be a block week on PRA, a tutorial, and independent study. The total credit hours for the module is 120, and it is uh, segregated into different credit hours, lecture for 45 hours, practical 30 hours, tutorial 15 hours, independent study 30 hours. Assessment approaches. Assignment 1 will be of 20%. Here the students will be divided into groups and assigned different topics relevant to the module. The group will prepare videos, drama or poster, and or models on assigned topics. Students' work will be assessed for 20%, which will be divided as the presentation will be assessed out of 10% based on content, language, delivery, ability to answer questions, and use of visual aids, all of which will be assessed out of 2%. Report will also be assessed out of 10% based on introduction, which will be of 2%, Facts and figures will be assessed out of 3%, arguments will be assessed out of 2%, conclusion of 2%, and overall presentation will be assessed out of 10%, totaling up to 10%. We will further look into these assessment criteria prior to the assignment. B. Block week, which will be out of 20%. Here, the students will have block week on PRA and RRA. They will prepare block week report and present what they did to the Gewok Extension Officer and the farmers. The work will be assessed based on the following criteria. Report will be out of 10% based on introduction, facts and figures, argument, conclusion, and overall presentation. Number two, presentation out of 10%, which will also be assessed based on content, language, delivery, ability to answer questions, and use of visual aids. C. Mid-semester test will be conducted out of 20%. Here, the module tutor will conduct written exam for one hour during the eighth week. The exam will be of 50 marks, which will later be converted to 20%. D. Semester end examination of 40%. The semester end exam will be of two hours and it will have objective type, short question and essay type question answers. It will be conducted after the completion of the module. Overview of the assessment approaches and weightings. Here we have the area of assignments, quantity and weightings. A. Assignment will be one which will be assessed out of 20%. B. Block week will be one, which will also be assessed out of 20%. C, mid-semester examination will be one, which will also be assessed out of 20%. And D, semester end examination, one, which will be out of 40%. In total, these weightings will sum up to 100%. Subject matter, unit one will be on communication skills. Two, office management. Three, extension. Unit four, extension methods and extension approaches. Unit 5, Teaching Learning Process, Adoption and Diffusion Process. 6, Organizing Trainings. Unit 7, Social and Cultural Factors in Extension. Unit 8, 
Method Demonstration and Exhibition, Unit 9, Media Production, and Unit 10, Participatory Rural Appraisal. For subtopics under these units, please refer VLE. Reading List 1. Essential Reading These are the important materials that the students should read or refer to in order to better understand the module and its content. 2. Additional reading. These sources of information can provide the student with additional knowledge and understanding on the subject matter.